Hey you guys, it's Matt, and welcome to Hilton's Computer Repair. Now, I'm really, really tired, and I'm real OCD about this, because of the fact, like, whenever I go into somebody else's iTunes library, like, just to see what they got, I always see, like, track 01, track 02, unknown artist, unknown album, and that really makes me mad, and I told them, like, hey, how come you don't, like, specify who the artist is or whatever, and they're like, oh, well, see, I don't really know how. So if you guys are this type of person that doesn't know how to edit their sound files, I'm going to show you guys this today. So, welcome to a video on how to edit your music in iTunes and make your library look a heck of a lot prettier. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into iTunes. Yay, iTunes. Alright, so this is just going to be an example. So for right now we have track 01 from Unknown Artist. So let's take a listen and see what this is. Just by listening to that intro guitar riff, I can already tell that this is Metal Storm slash Face the Slayer by Slayer. So, how are we going to edit this? What you could do here is you could make sure that you clicked onto the audio file, go ahead and right click, select Get Info, and it'll show you like a little summary, it'll show you actual information itself, and you could also go to a bunch of different things and all that good stuff. So right now we're just going to pay attention to the info part. So name, you're going to type in the name of the song, in this case it's Metal Storm slash Ace The Slayer. Yeah. Alright, and the artist is Slayer, obviously. And the album, well, the album artist, you could basically put Slayer again, or you could just leave it alone if you want to, because once you have the main artist, you don't really have to focus on anything else. For the album, we're going to go ahead and click, uh, well, we're going to type in Show No Mercy. It's a really great album. You could also put the year, the track number that it was, the disc number of anything. There's a bunch of different stuff you can put here. Comments, if you want to specify the genre, I'll just put thrash metal. You could click if it's part of a compilation, you could put comments, your composer, if you want to group it somehow. So let's go ahead and click OK. And if you take a look at this nifty little player right here, you will notice that it says Metal Storm slash Face to Slayer by Slayer. And once you do this, your media will be really well organized and a lot of people won't give you ugly looks when they see track 01 and track 02 and a bunch of stuff like that. Alright, so now we're pretty much almost, we're pretty much already done. That's really all you have to do. All you simply gotta do is just click, just right click, get info, go to info and just uh, go ahead and switch up the little things that it tells you to do. So we can go ahead and exit out of this, and exit out of that since our changes are already saved automatically. So, like I said, this is already Matt. Thank you guys for watching this video on how to edit your songs and or basically edit your media in iTunes. And hopefully this helped you guys out a lot. Don't forget to check out our millions of other awesome computer tutorials and tweaks. I'll catch you guys on the flip side, and I'll see you all in the next video.